The crawl here. Sorry to disturb you so late, Lieutenant Commander, but you have an incoming with your transmission. At this hour? Yes, ma'am. Shall I put it through? Okay. John Sigorski. Long time no see, Denise. You got to be kidding me. Well, good to see you too. What happened 15 years ago? You just vanished. Well, I had to leave in a hurry. You couldn't even say one simple goodbye. Well, I did care about us, and I still do. We're, we're done. We're so done. Now I really need to sleep. Denise, I need you. What? I need your expertise. Why? Listen, Denise, I should have been telling you this, even if this is a secure channel. But I see no other option. We found a time rift. No way. Yeah, and guess what? What? It's stable. When was it uh, discovered? We got the first sporadic indications of its existence 15 years ago. I was selected for the covert team assigned to locate and verify its existence. But why didn't you tell me? Believe me, I had no choice back then. Everything was totally hush-hush. It took until recently until we had pinpointed its exact location and collected all the necessary data. Now I've been challenged to put together a team that will conduct further investigations of the rift as well as securing it from unauthorized intrusion. Okay. And I want you to join this crew. Actually, I've already requested it from Starfleet Command. Look, I have a job here. Well, active from tomorrow, you are officially reassigned to our new research station. Okay, you could have asked me first. I'm asking you now. <laughs> With our common scientific background, I think we'll make a great team. Your ship will rendezvous at our station tomorrow at 1900 hours. Whatever. And please remember that all this is classified information. You cannot discuss it with anyone. <laughs> Leave me alone, I need to sleep. Channel 2 transport. Shannon Open. Anachronian Starbase here. Captain Park is speaking. Requesting coordinates for transport. Sending coordinates now. Coordinates received. Okay. Well, Lieutenant Commander, it has been a pleasure to have you aboard. Thank you, sir. Energize. Oh, welcome to the Anachronia Starbase, Lieutenant Commander. We've been expecting you. Thank you, Ensign. Hmm, Lieutenant Jameson will escort you to Commander Sigarski. Okay.
Return and tell her crop. Please follow me. Impressive, yeah? Yes, very. How oh, well? Do you know Commander Sigarsky? Well, we used to work rather closely together 15 years ago. Why? How close? Excuse me? Please answer the question. <laughs> You're way out of your line, Lieutenant. No, no, please. No, I'm not. Please answer the question. I don't have to answer to you. Oh, Denise, so good to see you. Likewise. And I see you still wear those uh, ancient 20th century eye correction devices. Yes, but that's none of your business. Whatever you say. This is uh, Vera Vasilieva, head of our science department and one fourth of our command group. Okay, so with you and me, that makes us three? Yes, and I believe you already met Karen Jameson. I sure did. John. Yes? What's wrong with that woman? Who? Lieutenant Jameson. Karen, how do you mean? Well, she confronted me with a rather personal question about you and me. Is there anything I should know? Well, um, there has been some issues, but uh, nothing important. Karen is a fine officer. Okay, since you're on the first name basis with the lieutenant, I'm sure you'll work it out. Um, and uh, Dr. Silenopoulos would like to see you in sick bay as soon as possible, if you could report there. Sure. And at 1400 hours, we have a briefing in the assembly room. I'll be there. If you like, I can assign someone to show you to sick bay. <laughs> no need. I'll manage. Okay. Enter. You wanted to see me, Doctor? Mm, please, have a seat. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, Lieutenant Commander Lacroix, I presume? Yes, but Denise will do. Okay, Denise. I'm Dr. Silenopoulos, head of our modest medical facilities here. Okay. And Penelope will also do just fine. Just a routine examination for all new personnel here. Okay. It'll just take a few more seconds. Okay. Ah, there. That's all. I'll analyze the results more thoroughly later. But from what I can see, everything looks perfectly in order. Okay. <laughs> now, Denise, I'd really like to talk more, but I have too much work at the moment. Mm -hmm. Maybe later, when everything is up and running here. Sounds like a plan. And see you at the briefing later. Oh, absolutely. I know you've all been eager to finally get some information on this project and what we're doing out here. I must start by telling you that most of it is classified, but I'll let you in on as much as I can. Now, we have no time to lose. If you could please pay attention to the table screen. Welcome to Anachronia and Project Temporia. This is a classified type alpha project. We will be test pilots for new Starfleet uniforms and equipment. Our priority mission is to... Vera and Denise, I need you in the control room. Karen, tell me that you're with me. Sigorsky here, give me an update. Updating now, sir. One senior life form moving towards the gate. Did you get that, sir? Got it. We're going in. Are you crazy, John? I would screw you the men against that, sir. There's no other way to find out who's in there. You sure there's another option? That's enough, number one. Open the damn gate! 
Open that gate and seal off the rest of the base for God's sake. Closing emergency doors. Opening security gate. Good thinking, number one. Okay, this is it. Dr. Sidney Openness, you wait here. Yes, sir. Karen, let's see what's inside, but with caution. Affirmative. Going into the tunnel with Lieutenant Jameson. Hold it. Oh, my. What's that noise? I think she's trying to communicate. But don't we have a translator installed? We should have. Cigars get to control. Control here. What's wrong with the universal translator? I really need it working here. Now. Hang on, sir. What's wrong with the universal translating system? It's not working. Well, fix it. I do my best, man. Please, we mean you no harm at all. Karen, lower your weapon. Lower your weapon, Karen. It's okay, it's okay. Slowly. We only want to communicate. We mean you absolutely no harm. Where is my translator? Translating systems back online. Okay, this is it. We mean you no harm. Do you understand me? Yes. Good. Excellent. Who are you? My name is John Sigarski, and I lead a team of explorers. And that one? That's Karen. She's part of my team. She's hostile. No, 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 no. She's not hostile. We're just all a bit tense of the situation here. May I ask who you are? I am Romia, the first level scientist in the Anachromian Research Scheme. Good to meet you, Romia. Are you here alone? I have come to the conclusion that I am the last of my kind. Oh, geez. That's enough, Lieutenant. Um, look, Veronia, I would love to continue this discussion elsewhere in the more quiet surroundings. Would that be okay with you? I trust you, but I don't trust her. Okay, Lieutenant Jameson, you're dismissed. What's happening? Shut up! Doctor, I need you here. This is our medical officer, Dr. Silenopoulos. Hello. She's a good being, but so sad inside. Uh, yes, she is. Uh, I hope you find it acceptable to join our doctor for a quick medical examination before we continue our discussion. That's acceptable. Good, thank you, thank you so much. Now please, please follow us. Immediate action needed. Repeat, immediate.